we are going to brave the snow to check on the homestead and the little banty chickens you know see if we have to move them into a stable didn't expect to get this much snow it's kind of sleeting a little bit but don't forget to there's... tell them that there's a hill we have to go up. Oh, there's a hill we have to go up are you ready <laughs> we got about an inch of snow added last night we gotta be up to like seven seven something inches now we live on a hill on top of a hill This gives me flashbacks of like when dad used to drive us in the snow, you know, <laughs> and like out in the farm area. I like it. Lots of horses and cows and people will hay the fields and some corn. We had these uh, we had these uh, search and rescue vehicles back when my ESAR days, and they were 1980s uh, Suburbans, and you had to go out and turn the uh, hubs. You had to lock lock the hubs manually, lock it. Now they have all like you hit a button and it just automatically does it for you. So and then we would put chains on them on top of that, and then we would go up to do our our training our course one and two training which was always in the snow because if you do your training in the snow then you're training in the worst elements out here and then everything else is just cake which is you know pretty pretty accurate um boy it would be like three feet of snow and there was nothing stopping those things and we were we were driving up uh you know making sure all of the the recruits or the 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 trainees as we call them wouldn't get lost following uh, a bad compass bearing, you know, make sure they were still hitting their marks and meeting them at checkpoints. That was fun. Those were good days, but this really does kind of bring back a flashback to the ESAR days of just doing course one and two training out in the mountains and the snow. Of course, this is nothing compared to the snow we were in, but still kind of nice. Okay, we're coming up to the hill. A little Here we bit of go. S curve hill. Let's hope nobody's coming <clears throat> hot around that corner because I'm coming. Yep. It's kind of sleeting a little bit now. It's slipping a little bit too. Yeah. I can feel it yeah. We'll have to go first gear on the way down. <laughs> <clears throat> that helps. I do that in the Mazda. wasn't so bad. It was a little yeah. slippery, but... I bet you that other hill was terrible. Oh, I know. That's going to be expensive. <clears throat> the sheep were out eating, being sheep. Garth, driving into the homestead. Oh, Nobody was in your property. <clears throat> yeah, that we know of. Well, I don't see any tire drive. Yeah. Yeah, I see wings flapping. Okay. Oh yeah, I see somebody moving. Yeah. I'm sure their water's frozen. You can just pull up and do it or whatever if you want to. Well, you just grab. Okay. Unless you want to stay on the asphalt. Yeah, I'm like. What do you think, Michelle? Huh? What do you think these tracks are to? A bunny? No, because bunny would look like hopping, maybe rat. Rat, <laughs> probably. Yeah. Huh? I don't know. So there's a stable over here. I don't know, whatever, it probably went under the barn. That's where the tracks stop. Are they even going in the house? Yeah, they are. Um, Yeah, I'm just knocking the ice out of it. Half it was frozen.
There you go, guys. Yeah, they're all alive. Drink your drink. Drink your drink. Yeah, more water. Oh, it's all frozen. <clears throat> I'll leave the snow on the top. It'll help insulate it. <clears throat> That's fine. I'm gonna, um, what I'm actually gonna do is I'm gonna build a lower door for them. This is like a storage, so I may actually put the hay in there for them. For what, their, what's that door for? Another coop. Yeah. Two separate coops. So I might actually do a lower door right here. Do a ramp. Whatever. How are you gonna get in there to get the eggs? I'll show you. Like how are you gonna step over that? And there's and there's oh, for you. mice in there, yeah. So I have to do a lower thing. Well, as soon as the chickens start going in there, that'll stop the mice from going. Yeah, in. yeah, yeah. I'll uh, the chickens all clean the all that out. Yeah. Um. And then this is storage, so I think I'll put their hay in here and maybe put a, a metal trash can with feed, yeah. so we're not going back and forth. Yeah. No. Just the bulb is dead or? There's no power to it. No line. They... Really? Yeah, they probably just plopped us here. So here we are, made it to the homestead, took care of our little banty chickens, gave them some water because the snow was filling up their water and uh, gave them some food. And uh, so they're gonna be good for today. They're still warm. They got lots of hay in their little coop. Um, so here's one of our little views, and uh, you can see all the snow. It's beautiful out. I kind of wish we had a couple of trees out here. Maybe what I'll have to do is try to plant a tree or, or something. Hopefully, nothing will. Uh, prevent it from growing off. I'll, I'll figure out what I'm going to do. That's non-toxic to animals. And here is the, the view of the back of the, where the kitchen's at. Here's the backyard. Nice little view. We got hummingbird feeders not frozen, so that's doing good. And so far I've only seen one hummingbird here drinking out of it. So I don't know where it's at. Uh, the bird feeder looks like it's empty. There's a gray, a, no, I think it's a, a blue bird, not a blue jay, something else. It's gray and blue, sitting up in the tree. <clears throat> well, I'm gonna get back to my sister's house where it's warm and stuff. So, I we'll have to, See if I'm gonna make it to work tomorrow or not. If it's gonna be like this, probably not. Well, we made it back in one piece. So it's good we went over there so we could take care of the little banty chickens check on the place and because uh, they needed some water and they they were getting really low on feed so we were able to top off their feed so they should be good for a couple of days so and I know the birds are going in there stealing some of it but whatever um, 
So all right, so hopefully this winter action will cease and desist for the rest of the year.